Good morning. I'm starting to realize how often I start my videos in the morning. It's just what makes sense, okay? It is a very cloudy day in Los Angeles today. I love it because that means our apartment isn't gonna overheat, but I was totally planning on sitting outside and getting a tan. That part kind of sucks, I'm not gonna lie. Anyway, welcome to my self-care Sunday reset routine. I honestly just wanna have a very chill day. It's almost my birthday. So I am just trying to do all the self-care that I can. I'm feeling really good right now after I just did my skincare. I want to do some Pilates this morning. I'm gonna probably do Move with Nicole. But first, I just wanna make a hot cup of coffee. I love to start my mornings with a hot drink. I'll usually have like my black coffee when I wake up and then in the middle of the day do like an iced coffee or a matcha. Okay, thank you guys for hanging out with me and let's get our day started. So for my workout today, I just followed a Pilates video by Move With Nicole, and she is my favorite YouTuber when it comes to following workouts. I have done reformer Pilates before, and I was absolutely obsessed with it, but it's just too expensive for me, and I feel like a lot of Matt Pilates classes are a little too simple, but Move With Nicole has the perfect videos to really challenge you. And after Pilates, I go ahead and I do some chin-ups with a resistance band, and I'm not sure what this machine is called, but it really works out my back, and I just really want to get stronger in that sense. The post-workout glow is happening. I also blow-dried my bangs before I worked out because they were looking interesting i think my bangs are too short but my hair grows really fast i just need to like keep going for the next two weeks and then by then they should start to grow out a little bit it's time to take a shower this is the body wash that i use i usually switch in between this one and any of the scents from method i think is what it's called <laughs> for some post shower self care. So I've never done this in my life, but I feel like it is time to hop on the trend. So we're gonna do a face ice bath. Um, I'm terrified, I'm not gonna lie. I usually ice roll my face and that is pretty manageable. I think this looks cute, so we're gonna do it. Ew, <laughs> I can't breathe. Not cute guys this is not fun kind of feels good though but i feel like i'm drowning i don't like it okay well i did that the aftermath feels good wow okay so i rate the ice face bath experience a six out of ten because number one i felt like i was literally drowning but my face does feel really good right now i'm definitely gonna stick to just the ice roller this is simply too much work it's too scary <laughs> I want to put on a face mask. I bought this whole pack from Amazon and they had different types of sheet masks. They had some for like relaxing and hydrating, but since it's the morning, I'm gonna go ahead and put this one on. I love sheet masks. They're my favorite ones to wear, but they look weird, okay? They look weird. <laughs>
my skin is prepped and clean, I just want to put on a little bit of makeup for two reasons. First being that I have acne here and I simply can't bear to look at it any longer. Number two, I'm trying to feel more comfortable with my hair. My ladies, if you know, you know, the look isn't complete until you have makeup on. I'm just gonna do my simple kind of everyday routine. I really don't change much. At the end of the day, I just wanna look good. So that's what we're doing. I'm gonna listen to Empire of the Vampire. If you've been following me for a minute, then you probably already know how much I love that book. I got the sequel to it and I got it physically. I haven't read it yet because I read the last one like two years ago. I just want to refresh my memory but it's free on Spotify so I highly recommend giving it a listen. I have 19 hours left. It's kind of a lot I'm not gonna lie but I'm listening to that and then I'm actually reading A Fate Inked in Blood. I'm gonna give you guys like a mini book haul as soon as I'm done with my makeup. <laughs> I wanna give you guys a little book haul. What I'm currently reading is A Fate Inked in Blood. I have just been seeing this cover everywhere. I was at Walmart and they had it for half off. So I was like, you know what, I gotta do it. And it has the blue foils on the edge of the papers. So I'm not sure, but I think they're discontinuing the blue edges. I have no idea. I was watching a video by Katherine Karas and I think she said that they were gonna discontinue it. So once I saw this, I was like, okay, I need to get it. It's a very easy, simple read. It's actually a fantasy romance, which I don't usually read, but I feel like romance is always in some way or another in books that I read. So I'm gonna read this, but also this is is the book that I got like a month ago, Empire of the Damned. It's the sequel to Empire of the Vampire. Guys, I'm so excited to read this, but I'm not gonna read it anytime soon. I still have to finish the audiobook. I wanna do some reading, and then after that, I wanna play Animal Crossing because I've been obsessed. <laughs> For my favorite portion of our self-care we are going to do an at-home manicure this is my current setup i have this uv lamp from amazon it's by the brand beetles and then i'm gonna do a color kind of outside of my comfort zone i'm gonna start with this basic creamy kind of light pink color and then i'm gonna do a layer of silver glitter we'll see how that looks i also have these uv gloves i've just been using these for when i drive because i'm gonna be using a gel lamp i'm gonna put these on and then i have my little nail file my clip some cotton balls and nail polish remover so the way i prep my nails is i will just file the edges as well as on top and then i'll take a cotton ball and wipe them down with the nail polish remover just to make sure they're dry i'm gonna put on my audiobook let's do our nails came out so cute. They're definitely super messy, but you know what? For a home done manicure, I'm not mad about it. Yay! And I am back home. I just had a shower. I need to moisturize. 
The ice cream that I got was Reese's peanut butter flavor. Anything with chocolate and peanut butter, I am absolutely in love with, but I'm feeling very satisfied. However, I'm also super bloated, making sure I'm moisturizing my eyelids. But I'm probably gonna read some more before I go to bed for the night. When I gave you guys the book haul, I was only on page like 50, but now I'm on almost page 200. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really wanna make some kind of like self-care video where I do a self-care routine that is as cheap as possible and something a little less materialistic. I think today I found a really good balance of having some really fun material items but then also having some self-care that really fed my mind and my soul. So I'd like to discover some more of that for the next self-care video. By the way, my birthday is in two weeks. So I'm gonna have like two birthday videos coming up, which I'm really excited about. I've been filming a birthday glow up video that I'm gonna finish filming tomorrow. And then of course I'll have my actual birthday vlog. And we're gonna be doing a lot of fun stuff here in LA. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in my next video, which will be my birthday glow up. Love you. Thank you.